hi there. Who is she? She is someone with a fierce fucking red lip. That's who. Mm, mm, mm. Making TikTok dances at home. I don't even know how to make a TikTok dance, but if you would like to learn my secret to a perfect red lip, then keep watching. Um, not my secret. I don't remember where I picked it up, but I've been doing this for ever, for as long as I wear a red lip, and that's a lot. Makes me look super Russian, you know? Um, makes you want to do this. Yeah, anyway. I've been stuck at home for too long, so let's get ready to go out. Um, follow these tips and you will have really nice red lips for more than 20 minutes before you even head out the door, you know? It'll last, you can have a couple drinks and then a quick touch up is all you're gonna need. So keep watching and like for more videos. Toodles. All right guys, welcome back to my bathroom. Uh, for the perfect lid, there's no secret. Actually, there's like one secret, but there's just good products. So first, we're gonna start. I'm gonna put a little lip balm while we're getting ready. I'm just so, so excited, because with red lips, the biggest thing is you don't want cracks, because it does not look cute. If your lips are dehydrated, you could use a lip scrub, or take your toothbrush, brush your lips. So what we are going to need, a tissue or a piece of toilet paper for, what's that word? You know, then another two pieces or one or a Kleenex for the little trick. You're gonna need a lip liner and a red lipstick. You're gonna need a concealer, have a couple of Q-tips handy and Translucent powder and a big brush. So in terms of my lipstick, what I like, what I don't like, you need to find what color is right for you. So for my complexion, pure red, like Ferrari red, stiletto, not stiletto red, that's not right. I just think of, yeah, Louboutin red, whatever. Like berries don't look good on me. You need to find like your kind of red, brown red, berry red, pink red, orange red, whatever works for you. So for me, I've had this, it's called the Be Legendary Lipstick Infrared Matte by Smashbox. I've had this for a very, 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 very long time. Uh, as you can see, it's like, she beat up. She fell out on me yesterday. Whoops. So that is my favorite red. Then for a lip liner, honestly, I think this is Pinaud. I don't know what that brand is to be honest with you, but I'm made in Germany. I like it because it is a little screw. And so for the lip liner, I like to have a little bit darker um, and something nice and smooth to just start the process. I'll, we'll, we'll go through it together. A liner that's slightly darker than your lip color. And for concealer, don't go for a liquid one, go for more creamy. All right, oh, and have a little wet nap. Clearly I've been having a red lip day today. Um, have that handy just in case. All right, so you have your lips moisturized, they're ready to go. So you take your lip liner, you start out outlining. I like to do the Cupid's bow, then a little darker underneath, and then I kind of fill my lip in with this. So we're gonna go through it. To define my Cupid bow a lot, I like my Cupid bow. Um, if you don't, that's cool too, whatever. So, and I do a little bit darker right there. Okay. So now you can start cleaning up the line. The trick to a perfect red lip is crisp, clean lines. Okay, so now. Up. Okay. Honestly, for some people, that's enough, and you're ready to go out the door. I need more. It's not a red lip. This is a rougey lip. Okay, so now we start, and we're not gonna like apply. We're gonna dab it, okay? Just 
Q-tip comes in handy. So now, so you don't get it on your teeth. It could have all ended up on your teeth, like that random teacher you had. I had red lips. Okay. Now we're gonna get the excess. Then we're gonna take our concealer. We're gonna outline a little bit here. The top is actually fine, it's my lower lip that's a little bit bigger. So here you can use your concealer brush or if you're happy with how dark it is, you take your little translucent powder. You can use a lot here. So we're gonna do this. And you have smudge proof lips like they still leave a mark but so it's not like I'm not promoting a smudge proof lipstick here what I'm promoting is lipstick that stays on while you drink and you're dancing for longer than 20 minutes because the bitch about red lips is is what's the point of spending an hour on your lips if they're just gonna get ruined. So, little two cents on red lipstick. And I think it looks pretty darn good. You can also just go over just a, like a little, cause I do this throughout the night. And honestly, sometimes I just bring the pencil and I just to liven it up or We'll take our pencil. Clearly, that's the last of the pencil, so I like this one a lot. Sometimes I'll just go over. Really helps when you have lip balm on, because it just glides right on. Then you have kissable red lips, but don't kiss with red lips, because then it goes everywhere. You won't get that line under your lip. It is great. Guys, I hope these tips help you on your red lip journey. Um, remember, make sure you find the right tone of red that works for your complexion because like, if you're white as hell, this is not gonna work for your kind of more creamy skin type. So you gotta make sure you go and find the right color for you. Um, but follow these tips and hopefully you have long lasting red lips that go longer than you just walking out the door after one drink so it'll be at least three drinks okay so whenever we're allowed to go out the door and get those drinks i hope these work for you stay tuned for more videos let me know comment like subscribe if you like this if the tips helped if they worked for you if you already knew these tips let me know and we'll see you next week all right bye bye